This is Matt. And he says, shit, we good alone too. I don't need anything you self-loving women have to offer, which isn't much. Hi, Matt. I'm one of the self-loving women over here. As a matter of fact, I have a, a ton of women that follow me that are also on the journey to learn to love themselves or already have discovered how to love themselves and value themselves. And we couldn't be happier. So here's how self-love works. You got to deconstruct and tear out a lot of stuff that you're raised to believe about what a man should be like and what a woman should be like. All those society constructs. You probably have to deconstruct maybe religious beliefs as well, financial beliefs, relationship beliefs. And then your purpose is to reflect on yourself, heal your trauma, heal your childhood wounds. And you know you have them because you tend to overreact in situations like this one. You got to clean up all those ruminating thoughts of self-hate because when you have all that hate in your heart, it spills out to all the people around you. Like here, you got to comfort that pain inside of you so that you're not walking around like an angry toddler saying mean things to strange women on the internet. And the best part is, is once you learn to love and value yourself, you will have an easier time identifying people who also love and value themselves. And healthy people can find healthy people. Instead, what happens is unhealthy people find unhealthy people, and then it just creates an unhealthy situation. The fact that you don't want a woman to love herself, now that's concerning. Like, if you had a daughter, wouldn't you want her to love herself? Also, the fact that you think love is about what someone can offer you, as opposed to loving them for just who they are, means that maybe you want to deconstruct your thoughts on what love is. I suggest therapy, healing your trauma, uh, meditating, reading some really good self-help books, going to the gym to work out that anger, and really just trying to move in love and not so much hate, because it's very telling. I hope you learn to love yourself and give yourself whatever it is that you need other people to offer to you.